what's up it's alicia jones welcome back to my channel if you're new here hey how you doing please support me by subscribing if you like what you see all right y'all so in today's video i will be reviewing outtrays water wave this is in 14 inches and i got it from my local beauty supply for $5.99 a pack so this hair it came pre-looped with a rubber band I got six packs, but I only ended up using five and a half. This is what it looks like. If you have not checked out my install video, go ahead and go check that out. Um, I did my first full headed braidless crochet. This is just what the hair looks like. This is that pre-loop that they're talking about and the little rubber band. And then this is just a curl. Now what got me is I've never tried this style by Outre and i like the hair color so the color is f430 and i just like the water wave i have been wearing this hair just shy of a week okay and i thought i would come on here review it first day install the hair was big beautiful pretty and you know but still had a little bounce to it and all of that but um after that like because i did my hair like this because i wanted to just have a new crochet style i was gonna be having surgery and um so first day hair really pretty really beautiful it was really big at first as y'all can see it's a little bit smaller i took a, a razor and thinned it out and i tried to go with a little bang okay so the install was pretty easy the only thing i did was pop the rubber band off i wasn't feeling it for the back the first bag i just installed it like this and then as i got further along i pulled the hair apart once that is where i kind of feel like i messed up at and you guys know that when i'm done with my styles i finish up with some mousse this is the mousse that i use this is aussie's headstrong volume volume mousse y'all gotta forgive me like I got my teeth taken out last week four wisdom teeth and i'm still trying to get back in the swing of things um talking is like so funny it's like this like whistling thing that my mouth is doing is oh man but okay well this is how it comes packaged i didn't even show you guys i'm so sorry this is how it comes packaged it's flame retardant um supposed to give you a fast install soft to the touch lightweight tension free low maintenance heat friendly with great curl retention i do say this hair was a very very easy install i didn't have no problems looping it on there very very it's so lightweight like with it's, as full as it was at first you would have thought that my hair was heavy but it was not for the first like four to five days after my surgery i literally kept my hair up I kept my hair up I kept my hair away so in a bonnet because I personally feel like if you got crochet braids in even if you just chilling laying down in the bed you need to have that bonnet on girl you got to have it on so you can keep your hair up now you can still see the curl pattern you know it kind of gives it that more natural look for me as far as like uh because I mean like look at that it still looks good I mean this looks like it could be my own hair with how the curls have settled now now with I, and i'm telling you i was feeling horrible so even with me feeling horrible i still went in detangled pulled it apart cut away those uh frizzy ends and all of that but i don't know i just feel like my efforts just didn't go nowhere because the hair is just so tangled and i know it's i know me pulling it apart played a big part in it but um I just feel like because a lot of the ends they look like that they're just so see I've been cutting away so much which is why it, some of it looks so choppy because I've been cutting away so many of the so many of the straggly ends the matted all of that stuff so yeah y'all the install took me probably about two and a half hours um i was on the time limit because i wanted to have my hair done so i could get the surgery done this is a premium multi-blend fiber um the hair when i first installed it so soft so soft yeah 
So the hair is so soft. I mean, y'all, it's it's so there's like literally no tension at all. It feels like I have like a lightweight wig on, or it just feels like this could be my own hair. I don't know if it's because of the braidless crochet and I ain't got no cornrows, but y'all. But the only thing is. I don't think I would get my four weeks out of this hair. Like, I would have to put in some work and literally go in and detangle and put mousse on this hair every day. And for me, girl, I like styles that I don't have to do a whole lot of stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't have to... I like low-maintenance styles. You know what I'm saying? So, I have literally have worn crochet hairs where all I have to do is put it up in a bonnet. That's it. Every couple days, go through cut out the frizzies and all that but this i've had to do that shit every day almost you know because i'm like man i don't feel good but i want this hair to last i still gotta go through and detangle it now i've put mousse on this hair three times since i've installed it okay so three times all the other the first time since i installed when i after i got done installing it the second time is when i was detangling it and then the third time again today when i was trying to go through and try to make it look a little bit presentable but i mean it still got this bounce but i feel like if you want to get the full use out of this hair you better not pull it apart so with that being said you probably are going to need to use all the six maybe seven packs now if i would have went in and pulled that first pack apart then i probably only would have needed four packs but i got to five and a half because i pulled that i kept the first pack as is but i tried to go in with a bang to do a, to go in you know just have a little bit of a different look because it was just so big but um as y'all can see like it looks so pretty but the moment you pull it apart it gets so frizzy so uh yeah so look so and most hairs when you pull them apart when you add that mousse to them it'll tame that frizz but with this hair i just feel like it was like nah chick we i, I ain't trying to get tame i want to be big i want to still be frizzy so this hair was like girl nah we ain't here we ain't trying to do what you want so you see like struggle that frizz right there but i don't know i feel like if you if, if you gonna wear this hair for like two weeks and then try something else then you can do it but if you want to do like four weeks if you want to take this hair on vacation you want to swim with this hair i'm putting mousse on it if you want to take it on vacation you want to swim with this hair baby girl you bet not because you're gonna have a matted ass mess I'm telling you now this hair did not get wet but the way it's acting now I can already see I can already tell that and you see like it's still down here it's just like no this mousse is not doing nothing for me I ain't trying to do what you want me to do the top part is tamed a little bit but that bottom part I just want to give y'all an example but yeah so for this if you want a quick style two weeks max go on ahead get this hair i mean it's affordable but if you're looking for a long long time nah sis this ain't for you if you're trying to look for a vacation hair nah sis this ain't for you my last video i did the lulu tress um i did the lulu tress hair and that hair i swam in that hair i kept it up in a bun and even after i did my review video i wore the hair a little bit longer and it was still looking good now Lulu Tress Bohemian, I wasn't really feeling that, but this is a part, this outtray hair is a part of expression. So I don't know if that got a part to play in it, but yeah, even with me adding that, it's still like untamable, which most crochet hairs you can tame. But um this particular hair, I do have crochet hairs that if I love it, I'll definitely try it again. But this particular crochet hair, I'm just like, I'm going to try it that one time and then just be done with it. Unless I just want to go in and just wear something real cute, something big. But I probably will not be trying this hair again. And me personally, I would not recommend it for a long term hair. 
now if you like to change up your hairs a lot if you change your hair every two weeks then girl it's for you because you're gonna be taking it down you're not going you you're not going to be wearing it for four to six weeks max colors cute soft lightweight but a low maintenance hair mm -mm. Cause I, I had to cut the matted part. You gotta cut the matted parts out. I don't know. I mean, it's still cute, but it was sometimes where I was looking. I would take that bonnet off, fluff it out, and I'd be like, "Damn, already! Like I literally just did this hair. Like, what's going on?" No! No! It just got hella frizzy, hella dry, hella quick. You know what I'm saying? So this is it this is the hair i'll trade waterway 14 inches i wanted to try something new y'all know i like to come on here try to do a review of the crochet hair before i take it out and in this case i'm about to take this hair out i'm gonna try something else now usually in the summertime i usually rock some braids or some locks but that lulu dress got me feeling a little spicy it got me wanting to try some more hairs and see if i can swim in them and stuff but um yeah y'all so that is pretty much it for this video i wanted to keep it short sweet to the point because i mean it really wasn't that much to talk about with this hair um it does have that a more natural look the older that it gets but i mean i wanted to wear this hair a little bit longer and i mean I just ain't feeling it like that no more but all right y'all that is pretty much it for this video please like comment and subscribe if you're not already subscribed if you like what you see like i want y'all to like what you see i want you to like my content i don't want you to just subscribe because i say subscribe because if you subscribe just because i say subscribe and you don't like the content you're not gonna watch you know what i'm saying so you have to enjoy what i'm putting out to subscribe to the channel i mean at least that's how i do for people like when people say subscribe i don't subscribe unless i like the content you know what i mean but all right y'all i will see y'all in the next video peace